that. Agriculture CS Mwangi Kyunjuri is opening up a two-day workshop in Mombasa on livestock insurance. Let's listen in. Encourage insurance companies to carry out voluntary insurance schemes in order to enhance sustainability of these products. In addition to livestock insurance support, my ministry is implementing other programs that are aimed at improving the resilience and livelihoods of pastoral communities in the Aso counties. With the support of the World Bank, the national government has invested 9.8 billion through a five-year regional pastoral livelihoods resilience project to improve the livelihoods of communities living in the 14 ASO counties. This program will focus on improving livestock, water structures, water pans and boreholes, construction of cereals, and border inspection, inspection points, established establishment of livestock breeding centers, and equipping county and regional laboratories. Further, through the support from African Development Bank and national government, in collaboration with the county governments of Masabit, Baringo, West Pokot, Trukana, Sabulu, and Isuru, the ministry has invested in programs to develop further irrigation schemes and increase irrigated land, improve pasture, and rehabilitation of livestock markets. Further, the Swedish government, through the countrywide agriculture sector development pro support program, is investing heavily in environmentally resilient and socially inclusive value chain development at the county level. I am also happy to announce that as we, I am also happy to announce that we are at the initial stages of implementing a climate smart agriculture program with support from the World Bank. I thank all these development partners and the GIZ who have supported these capacity building events for their continued support. Finally, honorable members and ladies and gentlemen, the objective of this seminar is to appraise you on the status of the Kenya Insurance Program, Kenya Livestock Insurance Program. We recognize your critical, crucial role, spelling, we recognize your crucial role in helping us push through the program's agenda in terms of policy formulation and budgetary requirements. I thank you once again for making time and wish you fruitful deliberation and call for your support for this program and all programs that the ministry will be putting to, uh, forward to drive hundred percent food and nutrition agenda. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, all of our members, in addition to the insurance, the ministry and the government, they say the government is taking very serious and large commissions to ensure that we support pastoralists. And uh, to come up with projects that are sustainable, and one of the things we are going to do is to ensure that whatever we do can be followed up, can be able to be measured. Because there are so many interventions that we are coming up with, firefighting each and every day. Today we come with a solution. After a year or two years, it's forgotten. We initiate a uh, project that you cannot be able to say or show in another two, three years. Today, we come in, all of us are there to do water pans, to do small dams, which after two, three years, you can even cultivate on the same land. 
you cannot be able to tell whether there was a borehole or not. I happen to have, uh, have uh, had the advantage of crisscrossing all the ASO counties. I think I know the 23 ASO counties, not more than five people in this country, apart from those who come from those counties, who can tell you what is happening in those counties. I have been in every of those counties. I have gone to many of these uh, uh, constituencies' wards. Uh, Adam, you will be able to testify to that. Uh, most of you, we have been together on the ground. What worries me now, as the Minister for Water and Irrigation, is that when you look at the record of the water pans and boreholes that are supposed to have been constructed, and if you look at physically on the ground what is there, then you know that you have a problem. And therefore, as we register farmers, and farmers means all of us, from the fish farmer, livestock farmer, and the crop farmer. We are also going to register a very ambitious program of registering any intervention that is done. If I do a borehole today, that borehole must be known by its name. That borehole must contain all its information from the GPS, where that borehole is, the amount of water that we expect from that borehole, and the period it can serve the people, so that we also inform you on the usage of that borehole. And we should even know the lifespan of that borehole. So that instead of doing a borehole every, uh, no, water pan, and also boreholes. So instead of doing water pans, year in, year out, let us have a program to know that this year we did 100 water pans. And then we know that that water pan must be disputed after two and a half years. So that after two and a half years, the program that we have is disputing water pans, not doing new water pans. Otherwise, it will be uh, the day in, day out, the same work that we are doing. Contractors make their money, they are very happy, go home. Number two, inspection, monitoring and evaluation. We are not doing it. Members of parliament, you have one role to play that is major oversight. I happen to have been a member of parliament for 15 years, and it elected, 15 years. Eh? I can see uh, Morek here. <laughs> Uh, I look the same. I would disappear <laughs> eh? if I would not know that I'm there. You know, more you used to ask, be what? <laughs> <laughs> you do not know this young man here in Parliament. And therefore, in my experience, I call upon you, members of Parliament, to execute your mandate, monitoring and evaluation. Not only oversighting the national government, but also oversighting the, national, the county government. Because today, if you look at history of your own constituency, from the county you are coming from, and you look at the water pans that have been done the last 10, 15 years, you realize that you are supposed to be having a, a, water, a, a water pan every 100 meters. You should be having a water pan. That is agricultural CS Mwangi Kunjuri opening a two-day